Hey guys, it's Rindy. I am here today with an exciting update, or at least I think so, for my Child of the 80s project pan. This is late this month. We were on vacation the beginning of the month when I would have done these updates, so I'm just sneaking them in amongst my other updates that are generally as on time as Rindy gets. If you hear music in the background, my kids are not talking about Bruno right now and they are distracted so that I can get this done. But let's get into what I have going on right here. And my first empty, we're calling it an empty, this is my Bite Try Lipstick. It is down to being dug out, which I will do, but for the sake of this project, this is an empty. For the sake of projects, I wait until it's flat, but I love this lipstick, I will be digging it out and it doesn't exist anymore. The company doesn't exist anymore. And I actually did find it when I saw that they were going out of business to have a 50% off sale. This is Bite Chai. This is their new formula, so I haven't tried it yet. Um, it's a soft matte. We will see. Um, maybe expect a comparison review in the future. I don't know. That's not a thing I really do, but if you wanna know how the new Bite holds up to the old bite now that they're going out of business <laughs> let me know so the next thing is the priming essence and this one is really gone like it's not even worth marking so it's not gone down much um I got my eyebrow pierced as soon as we got back from vacation so I haven't been wearing a full face of makeup so that I don't irritate this any more than I have to especially since it's been hot we've been sweaty and so I've been trying to keep makeup out of it even if I can't keep sweat out of it so the base products like this are going to be kind of slow going but I feel like I'm healed pretty well and so we I did use it today I did actually put on foundation today so we will get back into using that hopefully shortly the next empty is my Bath and Body Works Body Splash. This one is completely gone, like that tiny drop will not spray out, but otherwise that is another body spray out of my inventory. So in the trash with that one. The Physicians Formula Primer, that one is still unused because I'm still working on this one. My black shadow, let me get it out of my compact here. This is what she is looking like. And I've been using it on the outer corner of my eyes for most looks. I've been digging like one shadow color and then deepened up with this black shadow. Um, it's been simple, easy to do with the summer and everything else. So this one hasn't gone far. It went from 3.97 grams to 3.94 or 0.397 grams to 0.394 grams. I need to I need to get that together, but that's where that guy is looking. My Josie Moran oil, that one is upstairs by my bed. I'll forget to bring it down or forget to bring it back up if I do bring it down. My Cornflower Blue Polish, this one is still in here and it's so hard to see it running down, but I turned it this way and I could see a line slightly like right where it says nail so it may be able to be marked but it's what I've been wearing for most of the summer guys so it's it's getting somewhere but I do end up having to add thinner to it every few uses so that's part of why it's taking longer the next is my Dove dry shampoo this one, there's still a lot in here, but it did go from 54.592 grams to 51.366 grams. So it's been fine. It's a dry shampoo and Brindy doesn't do a lot with her hair. So we'll get through that. And I don't think dry shampoo is something I'm going to continue to have, but here it is. So the final thing that's in this project right now is the Ofra Body Illuminizer. And this one has moved ever so slightly from the green down to the blue. And we've had a very mild July up here, guys. It's only been shorts weather a couple of days. And so I put this on my legs when I'm wearing shorts. So that is the couple of days that I've been able to use this because I've been able to wear shorts. Otherwise, it's like capris or even pants weather up here. So all of y'all that have this heat wave, send some up my way. So, um, it's been warm enough. It's been warm enough. Never mind. Hold that thought. So 
never mind. But we are needing to, oh, I just added a, a, a zero to that. We are needing to choose more numbers. I do have my prompt sheet up here. So I have one through 80 on my number generator and 60 is generated and that one is unused. So let me add this in here. So 60 and then we'll click back over and generate again. 24. 24 is used. Let's generate again. 13. Also used. This is the problem when you get into these. 32. Also used. Let's keep going. 8. 8 is also used. 59. 59 is a new prompt. So we will go with the 60 and the 59 and I will be right back to show you what products I picked. All right guys, so number 60 is wax on, wax off. And I am, and the prompt is a product that contains wax. And I am putting in literal wax. This is the Zip Wax Hair Removal. This is, you can tell how old it is. And this is what the product looks like. It's actual like wax for body hair waxing and I've been meaning to try it because my legs get like kind of irritated when I shave a lot and with you know being shorts weather I kind of shave more than you know winter so I was going I've been meaning to try it so maybe putting it in the project will do that and along with my armpits because my armpits are so sensitive so we will we'll see where this gets us but it has it's this full block it has like little dividers in it so i'm guessing that intends to be eight uses but we'll see what that is i definitely want to give that a go and then number 59 is i gotta have more cowbell which the prompt is an integral part or the whatever prompt an integral part of your routine and if you know me put in the comments what I put in here for my integral part. So this is my Kula Mineral Face Sunscreen Matte Finish, which doesn't really matter to me, but this is where it is at up here. And it is a sunscreen SPF, SPF, SPF all the time. Um, the friends will be in the comments going SPF, SPF, SPF. So that is, that is what I am known for among my friend group. You've got to wear your SPF even when it's cloudy. So that one is number 59, my integral part. And that is everything. I'm excited to have a couple new products into this pan. It seems like we've been stagnant for a little while. So it is exciting to have two empties and have some more things put in here ready to go. And that's it. I hope you'll stick around. Check out my progress. Check out the other fantastic ladies in my collab, in this collab. And until the next time, I will talk to you all later.